Hello, super fans. I hope everyone's having a super great day today. Um, I am Tunatonian, and I am going to look at a couple of books from DC Comics. Um, I believe these were put out in 2017. So here we go. These are a couple of really nice hardback comics here. Um, we've got Batman, the Dark Prince Charming. This is book one of two. And then we also have Batman, the Dark Prince Charming, two of two. Both of these were put out by DC Comics. You can see Marini and Degard were the artists and writers that worked on them. Now, both of these are beautiful hardback editions, um, still in the plastic. I'm getting ready to open that one up right there. Um, and we will have a look inside in just a moment. Okay. So I did get these as a gift from um, DCU. DCU is DC Universe. That's their streaming service. So DCU streaming service, dcu.com. Um, wonderful app, lots of fun, super amazing community. Um, if you're not able to um, afford the service, um, you can always still, I believe, participate in the community um, without that. So. Without further ado, on DCU, the encyclopedia, I went and looked to see what they had to say about these books. It looks like it came out in 2017. Um, it was by the celebrated European creator, Enrico Marini. He puts his spin on the Cape Crusader. So it's about as Batman works to rescue a girl from the Joker's clutches. Um, I haven't read either one of these stories before and decided I wanted to go ahead and treat myself in I wanted to go ahead and give you guys a look at them as well. So here's book one and then book two. And it is just two books, so really nice. Um, hardback here, you can see about how thick they are. Sorry about that glare, it's something I'll be working on. Learning how to fix in the future. Okay, okay so a nice book here, let's see, let's see that. In the back. A nice little write up here with, by Jim Lee. Enrique Marini takes his place among the industry's best with his magnum opus, Batman the Dark Prince Charming. With evocative, lush imagery and confident filmic storytelling, Marini impressively delivers both a timeless classic take on Batman and something wholly innovative, bold, and brilliantly new. That was Jim by Jim Lee, publisher of DC Comics. You can see here, uh, it was, let's see, $12.99 in the U.S. Rated T+, plus, so teens and above, dccomics.com. Okay. And it's the ISBN in case you wanted to scan that or look it up. Okay. All right. Here is the side of it. Okay. All right, so without further ado, let's go ahead and, oh, that feels so nice, breaking that plastic. Ooh, I got these um, quite some time back. It's been quite a while since I received these from them, so. I do tend to hang on to things. It's gone. Okay. Hang on to things for a while before I open them for some reason. And I really like the quality of this cover. It's so nice. Um, oh, look at that. It's nice. I like that. Oh, yeah. Nice page. For those of us that are textual people, you're going to appreciate the feel of this book. Oh yeah. So, let's get a quick little look there. Yep, 2017. I did just receive them, you know, within this past year and a half, so. Okay, and I don't want to spoil all of it because I haven't read it yet and I'm really looking forward to it. So, I'm gonna do this quickly so I don't get anything ruined. And if you haven't read it yet, Maybe you don't want to pay too much attention to what we're seeing here. Okay. Okay. 
back has that nice black there too. They're very slick, very good. Yeah, that's nice. All right, so that was a quick look at book one of two of Batman the Dark Prince Charming by Marina, Marini and Degard. Okay, big day, we're gonna go ahead and break both of these open. All right, so you can see this one, book two of two. Pretty much the same, just about identical. Let's look. Just about identical. I'll have to get a page count on these for us. Might post that in the comments. Okay. Move the nice side. Mm -hmm. Boy, that's a nice cover. That's really nice. Of course, in I've had them uh, out in my house, and I haven't had this one on top because it's book two or two. I've had book one or two on top, so I've been looking at it for quite a while. First time I really looked at the front of this, and wow, well, that's nice. I like that. Okay. All right, and let's look at the back. What we got here? Oh, we don't have any write up by any like real people. We've got a fictional quote here, fictional character quote, the Joker. Let's see, if you remember on book one, you know, Jim Lee had made a little statement. In the back of this one it says, happy endings only occur in fairy tales, and this ain't one of these. This ain't one of those, sorry the glare got me. Uh, the Joker. So I'm imagining this is a, a statement from the book, or maybe that is like the last piece of the book. We'll have to open it up and read it to find out, right? So it says, happy endings only occur in fairy tales, and this ain't one of those, the Joker. Okay. Nice. All right, are we ready? Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Oh, there it is. my nails. No. <laughs> it's not about me. It's about the book. Oh, nice. Oh, here we go. Oh, oh, the plastic's gone. There it is. Oh, that looks nice, doesn't it? What a beautiful book. Okay, you ready? Flip through it real quick. Oh, first time it gets open. Do you hear that sound? Nice, looks pretty much like the other one. All right. Okay. There we go. Nice. Oh, that's nice. Oh, look at that artwork. That is beautiful. Look at that. Oh. Gorgeous, just gorgeous. Nice pages again, oh, just good quality, excellent. Oh yeah, that is so nice. I really appreciate the attention paid to the quality of the pages. I mean, that's just, yeah, if you're a tactile person, you really, really understand what that, what that's like. That's nice, it really makes a difference. Okay, let's quickly look through here. Again, I don't want to ruin it for myself, so I'm trying not to absorb it, just glancing. Okay. Oh, nice. Oh, look at that. Oh, beautiful. Beautiful, beautiful. Do a quick flip through. Gorgeous, right? Nice. And there we go. Nice black, solid black on both pages on the end. Yeah. So that is the set that I had received from DCU Streaming Service as a thank you gift. 
I really enjoy their community. It's really nice, so. I did not mean for this to be that long, wow. Okay, so there it is. Here's the set, the Dark Prince Charming. So, thank you, DCU Streaming Service, and thank you fans for keeping it interesting and engaging and fun. So, all right, we'll go ahead and put those, see right about there, and say thank you. Thank you for watching this video. If you like it, please like and subscribe, and have a great day. Bye.